that. I think that. <laughs> Wait, Newton loses. Is he playing? He's playing all ages, right? Is that what happened? Um. Yeah, he is in that in that place. I think. I think the Aegis lost to Rambo. Ah. Uh, That's I think what happened. It uh, went game three. It went game three. But I can do that. Oh, it's already reported. Look at that. Do you want to come, Chrissy? Oh, uh, if you want my headset, and I can come later. Hiski has got everything going for him. Hello, I've got my yogurt. He's got the yogurt, I'm he's shaking, got the comms headset. Is this Hiski gonna be a Fuji. mukbang? A what? Bang? A, a mukbang? A mukbang? Oh, uh, hang mukbang. on. Am I playing you, Razy, next? Yes, you are. Cool. Oh, yeah. Get get that yogurt noise right next to the microphone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I make sure not to eat, make, make too much noise. No, I wanna hear it. Yeah, there it is. Oh. Uh, uh, for all I, the viewers I, I at home. Like, lick it. Yeah, like, they're, no, because they're living through you. Oh my god. Can we, can we get play cams <laughs> while we're waiting for the match? Yeah, can we get com cams? Com cams? Well, I'll, I'll help you out. Alright. Oh, about to start. I don't know why I keep choosing stressful music for stretchful matchups. I'm like, I love this song, Dwelling of Doom. But it's like. So you're not the kind of player where stress powers you up? No, because you're playing Diddy. So if you monkey flip, you saw me game two, I died at 40. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, being relaxed is good. But I was like, I love this song, and I don't want to take too much time using music. I should have like a list on my phone. That's true, actually. I don't think I've ever picked music in a set aside from when I was playing Sands Nuts. and I would pick Megalovania. Megalovania, da 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 da. It's too good. The Tetris songs are always a good pick. They're so dramatic. Uh, you're player one. The Tetris songs? Big Tetris fan? Big Tetris music fan. I do enjoy a good Tet. Well, they're just uh, rehashes of classical music, really. Yeah. That, that's why they chose it originally, is because they didn't want... Well, actually, no, because it was Russian. And uh, communist Russia back in the day. Yeah. Actually, is Russia still a communi communist country? I don't know. No, it's not. Well, it's it's not no. currently. But not uh, currently. Yeah, it used to be. And, and at that, so the person who made Tetris actually didn't make a single dollar off it because he spread it with across like digital devices across his friends. Hmm. It's a whole legal thing, which I don't think we have time to get into today. It's because we have Xavier's Palutena? Yeah, the Palutena. So he did say he's playing Palu game one every match today. Um, oh, here we go. Bring him back. Wait, every game one or every match? Every game one. Every game one of every match. Why? Oh, well, because that's why. Is that why I was supposed to be like, is that that's, why? But that's why. Because, you know, he's trying to make the Palu work. He's trying to like have, have some oh, fun with the for secondary. Like, like Pac-Man or something? Those really annoying matchups you don't want to play. Probably, I think so. He Yoshi. is, Yoshi. he is definitely not a Pac-Man enjoyer. Hmm. Are you a Pac-Man enjoyer? I enjoy all characters. I don't mind the matchup until I get zero to ninety and I can't get in. But like the more I learn about a matchup, even if it's losing, I don't mind it that much. I enjoy the Pac-Man matchup much more if they taunt and we get to see what funny little pixel guy they pull. No, but I like the taunt where there's music because he's happy. That's true, but that you, he like opens his hand and the animation is so smooth and you don't know what you're gonna get. Nah. Like actually, the only character I get uh, tilted about losing is Ooh. Hero, for obvious reasons. Like I'm getting better. Like if I, as long as I don't get like giant test. Yeah, as long, hit, yeah. Which has happened oh. before. <laughs> um, yeah, That's I could. But my Diddy's like uh, flying against Hero now because I studied it pretty a lot. Yeah, Hero does sort of have that effect. He's like... The mental warfare aspect of thwacking someone at 30 cannot be... Yeah. Cannot be downplayed. But like, like I, I've kind of like gone into a Hero set now assuming I have bad luck. Yeah. Which has helped me out tremendously. Cause that's, I'm like, that's the way to do it, happen. right? It's like the same as Wario Waft, right? You go in expecting him to hit the Waft, so yeah. you know you need to like... Yeah, yeah, but now I'm kind of assuming he's got Waft every set. Yeah, you, like you, you assume that if you get F smashed by a hero, he's gonna crit you, you yeah. know, and, and that if 
if you get thwacked by a hero, you're going to die, right? Like, yeah. you just have to... And the weird thing is, like, with hero, against those kind of characters, you want to keep your distance. You want to stay away. But against hero, you want to stay, like, at most a platform distance away. Because mm. you want to be able to constantly pressure. Because he's only real good up close buttons are like what F tilt which are, is really slow yeah and then he's get out of jail option from his shield he's up B hmm. all right here we go is that kind of looking nice with his palu wait this is wash <laughs> yeah taken wash to, to last hit the sun tag is from when he was playing against Dan oh, who, who is canonically wash's dad I thought wash's dad was I was trying to make a pun using wash like <laughs> like wash like no no it was you like thought soap wash's or dad was he uses soap to wash no, no. yeah you need you need so he's yeah yeah he, what was, is the father bad. of the wash Mr. the wash. the rinse yeah that's it to rinse and wash a rinse and wash yeah i think before there was washing no, there was no, rinsing it, right it, it's condition yeah it's condition a oh, condition would be like after wash yeah so that's his like, child at the beginning before there was soap all you could do was like rinse your stuff you couldn't like actually wash your stuff of course and before that, there was nothing. Before that, there was nothing. Before water, there was nothing. Hmm. And then it really makes changed. you think. Also, we're going, um, this must be a best of three, five, right? Win winner's quarters, best of five. The Peach is here. Okay. I now, the know. turnips. Maybe. Oh, man, I'm actually exhausted from that. It might have some Oh, he's dead. He's he not dead. He's got the what Cypher. What the hell? He's got the That's Cypher. That's why goes so far. He didn't have a jump. The little helicopter. I mean, surely he had a jump, right? Because I was like, he doesn't have a C4. I guess on any stage besides Battlefield, which has a lower floor, he probably would have been in. Like, Smash yeah, Bill, that's, Lilac. that's another thing with Cypher, right? It takes, if you're falling, it takes a little bit of time to, like, reverse your air acceleration and, yeah. and get moving up. So sometimes you can die just because you Cypher too late and then you're, like, still moving down. That's rough. Just, uh -oh. like, just like in real life, you know? Damn, that crown hits hard. Mm. Is this crown? Infinite Azure playing? It sounds some, like the pool some sort one. of Tekken, Tekken some music. Kind of Tekken fanatics in the house. I don't, I don't know anything about Tekken. Except there's a bunch of guys hitting each other. Mm. It sounds like Smash Bros. Except it's like Monkey versus. Oh, I was gonna ask you a question. So, you oh know how it takes, takes guys different amounts of days to grow different amounts of facial hair, right? Yeah. Kind yeah. obvious. How long do you reckon it takes Snake? grow his beard. How long? That's a pretty full looking beard. Now, I feel like that's at least like a week. But maybe that says a 25 year old. Oh, okay. That up smash. Yeah, rough the eye. That is going to do it. Mm. I Like that amount of facial hair. See, the way that you can tell um, how long facial hair is not actually in my opinion, it's not actually the the length. It's the, the course. It's the density. Yeah, that's right? what I was looking at. And because yeah. it looks like you've just coloured snakes jawline in with a brown texture mm. because of that I think that this is quite a lengthy beard you know this no, is, no, this is this, in the months this is the follow up question the months like territory work it out like the older you are the faster your facial hair grows so how old do you reckon Snake is I reckon it's like 30 something I'm pretty sure canonically you can get his age I'm pretty sure like there's oh but, but it's gonna but be like 6,000 or like one year or something because isn't he spoilers a clone no but in the Metal Gear universe he's not a clone like uh, like uh, you come out of the test like tube and you're a full grown man right. he was still a baby at some oh, point oh so he's he's like a like an actual clone like an actual clone yeah yeah like raised from the N not like a yeah not a I'm Mewtwo I'm day one I'm day one I'm fully grown yeah, yeah yeah so he's a hang on maybe J Jason do you know how old Snake is the, the other issue so you, you know what the issue is with that question the issue is with that question is that this snake doesn't actually look like any of the snakes from the respective games what? There's like there's like a couple of different snakes. Yeah, yeah there's the, pro the, pro the problem the problem is is that um, Smash Bros. Snake is an amalgamation of multiple snakes. Mm. Like basically, it's he's basically two different characters that are like vaguely merged together. Oh, to make okay. A Smash so version. it's like both of them are like roughly it's middle aged. Middle, middle middle period. Snake, yeah. Where, which doesn't have a game. This snake is thirty five. He's at least thirty five. So yeah, I. 35 to 42, that's what our source is, Bin Yaman say. Mm. Uh, which makes me think that it couldn't be more than a month. A month or less. Yeah, no. Three weeks. No, I, I think it could be more than a month. Because people trim their beards. And to have yeah, that it, density it's, it's of facial hair. Well it's pretty well trimmed. 
Okay. <laughs> Maybe we should have commentated the game. We just talked about Snake's beard for the entire game. And we never got to the solution. Also, uh, Sav lived to 195. That's pretty good. Yeah, especially on, on the peach. Yeah. Peach. How long do you reckon how, how long, how long you you reckon Peach took to her facial hair? <laughs> hmm. How about her regular hair? Do you think she gets Peach Fuzz? <laughs> 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 no, the, re the real enigma is how, how long Peach has taken to grow out her hair, because that is long. Her hair has never grown or gotten shorter, though. We've never, like, seen her... Like, baby Actually, Peach? Actually, no, we've seen, like, we've seen ponytail, baby Peach? ponytail Peach, which, whose hair looks shorter. Hmm. But Baby Peach, that's like saying that, oh, yeah, she just never cut her hair. It grew to that length, and it never... That I hair is obviously trimmed. Yeah, of course. Mm. Alright, well... I think it's, like, always been long her whole life since she was a kid. And she's just had it trimmed. Because, mm. I don't know, Peach looks like she'll be, like, what, 28? 26, 28? Peach is, like, a little bit too cartoony for me to have any idea of her age. Yeah, but you can, like, look at Mar Mario, I feel like, is at least 30. Because she shows no signs of age. She doesn't have any, like wrinkles or like um like her skin is like i mean yeah she's it's got, just a, she's it's just a flat skin. color yeah yeah obviously you but know? like i don't know something like i feel like mm, i don't know i just feel like she couldn't be like early 20s and she's like probably not a teenager well at what does, point like, does she become a queen when her parents die and she's the only one left to rule but Goodbye. she's always the only one left. Yeah. So that means... Oh, she's not queen. She's princess total, right? Yeah. Which is, to is Toad's worth her father? These are the questions we're not meant to know. Mm. Nor are we meant to ask. That's why I think she could be younger, right? Because mm. queen generally... But like, you know, you can't use that because Prince Philip is like, what, 92 when he died? Yeah, but he's like a cryptid. Yeah. But like... What? This is this is like fairy tale. Mushroom Kingdom's like fairy tale nah. land. This isn't weird real life. I think where we have princes oh, who you know are what, 100 you know years what we old. Do? We should use the reference, the upcoming Mario movie. Who's playing Peach? Oh. All right. Now we should probably talk about the game. Actually, should I we? mean, what 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 do you want, chat? That, the that's... game. Oh, he snuck through the mortars. So that. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Can't jump and see four. You can't commentate this. Mm -hmm. It's just explosions and turnips and vegetables. And Dude. Okay, ledge trap situation. What will happen? Mom of Mia. There you go, Jabs. Oh, I like that. That little chase, little float, little follow. Looking really smooth. Are we winning this? From this oh, Snake catches the turnip and gets blown up by his own grenade. That's really sad. Hmm. Really makes you... It really makes you think, you know? Hmm. Why are there so many turnips? Why are there so many turnips? Where is she getting them all from? Oh, uh, it's because she's hacked the system. The ground is stone. I think Peach's turnips should be like Steve's materials. Like, it should be dependent on the stage. Dude, that would be evil, but it would be she, great. She should get, like, bricks if she's on Battlefield, because it's stone. <laughs> bricks would be, like, stage based but better every single thing. <laughs> no, and then if you're on, like, a grass stage, then you get turnips. Yeah, that makes sense. What if you're on, like... Um, I guess you could, like... If you're on Pokemon it's... Stadium, you get, like, that little... Oh, oh, you get Oddish. Oh my god, that would be so cute. I love Oddish. It's one of my favorites. I do I do like a good Oddish. Oh, oh my god. That Nair, almost killing, almost taking Wash's last stock at the crown. Wash didn't air dodge in those last three interactions and mm. just kind of died. But I think Zab positioned himself so that he could have done it. Mm, that's really interesting. Oh man. Small battlefield now. Mmm. Mm. What do you think? Do you think small battlefield is a different location to regular battlefield, or do you think that they just remove the top platform, like they get the little little guys to come in, get rid of that platform? I think it's an alternate universe. An alternate universe? We're getting into the, the multiverse theory. The platforms are different lengths and in different positions. Mm. Actually, I don't know about the different lengths. They're in different positions at least. You don't think they just move out? They just like leave and then come back, like no, with new ones? No, 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 no. I don't think so, because platforms are expensive. Because the base is the same, right? Yeah. And so is the background. Which yeah. makes me think. Which means they're in universe. cardinally the exact same. Yeah, actually, no, you're right. Yeah. They're and either in alternate universes. And it's happening at the same period of time. So it doesn't make sense to have both simultaneously available at once. That's true. But that's just a theory. Thanks for watching. That's awesome. Thanks, thanks, friendlies. Well, 
Zap kind of running away with this. After the Palu. Clutching it out. Peach doing damage. Yeah, the Snake. Peach. Oh, that was so nice. Oh, oh God, that was so dead. nice. Drifting back with the Duh. Peach Bomber and then catching that dash attack out of the corner. And then. Oh, and the footstool. Oh. Going for a spicy meatball there. Snake's feet are just too fast. Mm. Uh oh. In the corner, what Dude. will you do? There was so many. So many things. I don't know if even roll away was like would help you out there. I mean, there was a grenade. So you couldn't get up attack. There was too many things. I think it was literally just cornered. Yeah, you've been trapped. Snake has checkmated you. Mm. Oh. Wash looking a bit tricky. I like the idea with the footstool C4 detonation, but not finding the hit. Oh my god. Damn, that was a very nice grab. Peach, for me. Peach really do be just summoning Toad out of nowhere for that down throw. And then Toad just like using his head. Oh. Pisky is eating an apple currently, yeah. which is why he's experiencing apple technical difficulties. That's true. If you hate doctors, just get on the apples. Does this mean Pac-Man beats Dr. Mario? Pac-Man beats Dr. Mario. That's true. That makes sense. Pull the apple. Oh. It also means Villager can beat Dr. Mario <laughs> if you if Washington's you get lucky with the tree. Wash is bringing this back. Yeah, he's kind of looking... Okay. Ah, that's rough. Needed that one to pay off. But that's okay. Rolling back into the grenade. A little bit risky. <laughs> oh, no. And now he's in the sky. And the only thing in the sky... Bad at all. Yeah, that's rough. Probably. Are we playing after this? Okay, show me the... Oh, that was such a nice little string with the Z-drop, but the grenade break. Combo breaking with grenade is very good. Okay, 90% deficit for Wash. This, he can make this up and go into this game. Okay, never mind. Yeah. That umbrella was very clean with the JV2 for Zav taking that one 3 1.